Okay. This video is a quote unquote historical video in my uh, YouTube and video ways. Here it is. On January the 27th, 2007, which was the day before I made my Cassette Master YouTube account, I recorded this following song on this organ. Now, this organ has since been given away or sold after we moved to a new house, a smaller house, because the organ was way too big. But, this song I had recorded onto Betamax using a Sanyo VCR 4500. And before you get hyped up and think, oh, nice Betamax and stuff, oh, that Betamax broke, and actually broke a while back. And um, the ejector gear broke, and one of the pieces is gone, so it's pretty much unfixable. So it's unusable, but I played it back using the Sony SL5000, which played it back very nicely. It was recorded at a beta 2 speed. So, you'll know that this song was recorded on Betamax, and was I was playing some songs on the organ, and then my friend requested that I played a song for YouTube. So I played a song for YouTube with the idea and intent of this song being uploaded to YouTube. But the only thing was, not only did I not have a YouTube account at the time, although actually I did have a YouTube account, the Cassette 26 account, but at that, at that time I didn't remember the password and I wasn't able to get onto that account. So basically I had no YouTube account I could use. But to top things off, that wasn't the major problem, since I made a Cassette Master YouTube account the next day. But it wouldn't be uploaded all the way until five years later, because that, this song was recorded in, remember, January 27th, 2007. Seven, and now it's 2012. So here's the thing. Um, um, since I recorded it on Betamax... I didn't have a video capture card back then, and I wouldn't have a video capture card until five years later. Well, a little more than five years later, you know, whenever you tack on the months, the individual months. So, on um, um, the song, which was re made with the intent of going on YouTube, was never able to go on YouTube, unless I were to do the camera in front of TV technique, which was a crappy, terrible technique, which I decided with this song that I wouldn't upload it until I got a capture card. And lo and behold, I now have a capture card, thanks to John Clark. So I can now upload this song to YouTube, which is very special. Now let me know, I mean, now let me let you know that in the video on YouTube, what you will notice the brightness is not entirely consistent that is not the recording, as one might think, but it is the stupid computer's uh, way of handling the recording. On the television screen, when the recording is played back, the brightness is fine and consistent. But when the computer comes to processes, the modern computer's dislike for the old technology says, I'm going to make the brightness change so that people can think that beta is a bad format. But that is false. In reality, the brightness is fine and consistent when displayed on the television screen. But anyway, without further ado, I hope you enjoy this quote-unquote historical video done whenever I was 15 years old, whenever I would three months later turn 16 at the time of making the video. Um, of course... 2007, it was the day before I started the Cassette Master account, and I made it without being able to even upload it or put it on the computer to put it on YouTube. Enjoy. Hey, what? should record a song and play it on and, re and uh, put it on YouTube. <laughs> That'd be neat. Call it the YouTube song.
I did on here and yes I wasted lots of tape 